If you like to shop till you drop or you're a foodie, you're bound to find something to enjoy at an upcoming event in Hudsonville. Here to tell us a little bit more about the Farm Girl Flea Fall Market is Jessica Plasier. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having me. We appreciate it. So tell us about the idea behind this event and what people can expect when they go there. Yeah, well, we're a team of three women that put this event together. We established in 2016, and we decided just to host a fun event where our vendors can come and set up their wares, and customers can come and shop. So, Awesome. Yeah. So what can I expect if I go there? What am I going to see? Okay. Well, our fall market, we have a lot of fall-related items. So you can get your pumpkins, and you can get your moms, and then our vendors bring these amazing displays of vintage, handmade and just amazing home decor. So oh. it's like something for everybody. Plus we have food trucks and um, live music as well. Okay, so some of the things that people are making is going to be a lot of different things yeah, too. So you're gonna be able to see a lot of original pieces. Yes, it's all stuff that you would not see like in your typical box store. It's, you know, something that's made with love from someone in their home or right. someone that refinishes like an old antique piece and just That's cool. with history behind it. So yeah. it's just quite amazing. Some good stories in there to tell, yeah. I'm sure, yeah. while you kind of go treasure hunting a little bit. Yeah. So you mentioned a couple of other things going on, yes. music. We have um, a couple of bands that come on Friday and then two bands on Saturday. So we have the Rock Island Ramblers, which is a uh, country blues band, okay. and then Jake and Michaela Holt Band is on Saturday, and they're aspiring country artists from Indiana. So it's just a fun vibe for the two days that we're there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so a lot to do. Yeah. And you mentioned food trucks. Yes, there's delicious food. So anything from homemade barbecue to an awesome burger or even an ice cream cone, because I heard it's going to be warm this <laughs> It weekend, is going to be warm, so right. We're going to need that ice cream. So what's, what do you think this market means to the people in that community? You yeah. said you've been doing this since 2016. Yeah, I just think it's a great thing to have um, local people mm -hmm. and just bring more attention to West Michigan. I mean, why sure. not? Uh, right. <laughs> yeah, so but it's just something that's special and unique for anyone who's involved in participating or even shopping at the Farm Girl Flea, mm -hmm. so. You said two other friends of yours, the three of um, you just Yeah, my, just... actually my mom yeah. and my good friend Karen. So okay. we, and have, you just we have a blast together. <laughs> you just said, we need to do this. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. So. one more time, tell us where it is and when it's happening. Yeah, so it's this weekend, um, Friday, we open our doors at 4 p.m. till 8 p.m. And then also on Saturday, we open from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Okay, sounds like a lot of fun at the Hudsonville Fairgrounds, yes. right? Yes. Okay, Jessica, thank you so much for joining thank us. Thank you.